Down here at Bolton Arena, where you've just been doing a bit of a cardio with your, uh, your coaches. Yep. Um, I was going to ask you, how's everything gone? Because you should have been fighting last week, shouldn't you? Yeah, uh, should have been fighting on the six and a half um, at uh, I mean, Arena, but it got cancelled. Um, first of all, Felix Cash pulled out, so they're going to get me another opponent. And then the full show got um, stopped, but lucky enough, uh, Matt Shroom and Eddie Earn have got me on uh, the 2nd of August at Liverpool. So I've not done my full training camp for nothing. So it's, yeah, it's well, you're defending your, your. You also get a chance to defend your title Being because title, yeah. uh, you just won that in May, yeah. and then you were going to fight straight away for the Commonwealth. Uh, I suppose this is nice, really, because you get to fully appreciate what you've just won. Yeah, I mean, obviously, if you're winning the title, you you want to defend it anyway, don't you? Yeah. I mean, but I was getting offered. I was getting offered to fight for the Commonwealth, and I'm not going to take a fight like that. Day. No, you're not going to say anybody, that, uh, anybody who gets offered a, a title fight, the daft of them, the, the daft of them, uh, not take it. Is, if everything comes through this fight, because we'll, we'll talk about your opponent in a minute, but if everything does come through this fight and you, and you retain your title, will that fight with Felix Cash still happen? I'm hoping so, mate, yeah, I'm hoping so. That's, that's what I'm going for. I, 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 want, I want to win, I, I would like to win the Commonwealth, I mean, obviously. Uh, it's one of the big four, isn't it? It's a big one, yeah. Commonwealth, British. No reason not to. So that's that's what I'm looking for. Well, yeah. Let's get back to uh, August the second and your opponent. Your opponent is uh, John Harding Jr. Um, came late to, to to boxing. I believe uh, got in a bit of trouble when he was younger. Come out of uh, prison and he says boxing saved his life. Yeah, um, I don't really know much about him to be honest with you. Um, well, he's got a per uh, he's per he, he's unbeaten. Yeah, he's he's got seven yeah. wins with seven, one draw. Seven wins but draw. if you look at those seven wins, they're the seven wins that you'd expect to win. You know, uh, so he's not really stepped up. I don't think he's fought past six rounds. Yeah. And you're his first genuine step up in class. Yeah. So I do you mean, think? Um, it's too soon for him. Talk, but we'll see if he wants to walk. Yeah. Do you think it's too soon for him? I think it's too soon for him. Yeah. I think. Uh, I haven't been back too soon, but I just feel like I'm too good for him. I suppose at 34, though, he doesn't really have a chance to pick and choose what fights he gets, is he? No, this is a too swear. good opportunity for him to turn up. Yeah, I mean, obviously, I, I would if I, if I got offered a shot like this, if I got any type of shot, I wouldn't turn it down, so good on him for taking the fight. Yeah, well, like I say, it's a great opportunity for you on TV and everything, you know, yeah. up your profile. Yep. And uh, so when you do get that chance to fight for whether it's the Commonwealth or whatever other title, we know that's going to happen before the end of the year. Uh, people might know who you are, mate, outside of Bolton. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I mean, it's just going to be good. It's, good. it's going to be good to get a match room show. It's going to be on Sky. It's going to be live, and um, just need to give the best performance of my life. And a few. I think the top of the bill is um, um, Anthony Fowler against uh, Brian Rose. And then we've got Luz Ritson against um, Joe Hughes. Yeah. So, you know. Uh, there's, some good, there's some good lads on it. Yeah. Uh, as well as yourself. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> well, listen, good luck for August the uh, 2nd. Hopefully, I'll be chatting to you and you'll be. And still. And still. Yeah. Not polite. Not polite. Well, it's too good an opportunity for him, man of his stage, you know. But I just think it's too big an opportunity. Yeah. And uh, I'm not sure he'll be able to take it. So, Jack, good luck nice. for them. I'd like to say, all for the chat to you and stuff. Yeah, I'll Take care, mate. Bye. For all boxing, info, news, and latest interviews, amateur and pro across the north, click and subscribe. VIP boxing promotions. Also, Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook.